Sonsini Animal Shelter and this is Pause for Adoption. My name is Katrina White and I'm the Animal Care Coordinator here. We are a no-kill shelter. Uh, back in May we moved to a new location, 875 Crane Ave in Pittsfield. Um, we are still looking for a bigger um, facility so this is just a temporary location. Our hours are Tuesday through Friday 12 to 6 and Saturday and Sunday 12 to 5 closed on Monday. We solely rely on donations and you know whatever people um, can donate uh, as far as food, um, towels, blankets, paper towels. Um, we do have a wish list online. We have a website um, and you can also call the shelter anytime and ask uh, if, we, if we need anything specific. Um, today we are going to be showcasing each of our dogs individually, and our first dog is going to be Wesson. Hi, I'm Devin, and I'm here today with Rosie. Uh, she's a one-year-old lab mix. Um, she's a very sweet girl, great with people, uh, very calm in the house. Uh, we're not sure if she's potty trained yet, but she's very well behaved. Uh, doesn't go after cats too often. Um, we're not sure how she does yet with other dogs, but she's, uh, she seems to be very well behaved. That's all I have, That's all I have on Rosie. Hi, I'm Kat, and I'm an employee at the Eleanor Sonsini Animal Shelter. This is Bella. She's a five-year-old pit mix. Um, unfortunately, she is not good with other dogs or cats, but she loves everybody that she meets. She's house trained and will make a great couch potato cuddler, but she also has energy, so she could go to an active home just without any other animals. She's good with kids, people, just no animals. Again, this is Bella. Hi there, I'm here today with Charlie. Charlie is a uh, Siberian Husky mixed with a German Shepherd. Um, she is extremely uh, athletic. She takes, uh, she needs a lot of exercise. Um, uh, she's uh, an extremely smart dog. She knows all of her basic obedience commands. Uh, one downfall to Charlie is that she's not good with other dogs. Uh, she tries to uh, go after other dogs. So she'll have to go to an experienced home. An experienced home with no other animals uh, and someone who's extremely active uh, knows the breed. Um, uh, both Huskies and German Shepherds are known to be a little bit more difficult to, uh, to take care of. Um, and uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, no cats, um, no cats, no other dogs. She should be the only animal. Charlie here. Um, and she definitely needs a lot of structure and continued training. And I think with that, she would make a great, a great pet. She's awesome. This is Rufus. Rufus is a seven to eight year old lab mix. He came to us with 70 to 80% of his fur missing. Uh, we assumed some kind of flea allergy. 
He is now on a limited ingredient diet and melatonin twice a day. He's grown back probably 50% of his fur since we got him. Um, he is good with cats. He's leery of strangers. Um, he does not like kids. And he's okay with some dogs. Um, but he really hasn't been exposed to too many dogs. Rufus. 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 Come here. Sit. Rufus. Thank you. Thank you. And this is Rufus. All right. Here it This is Wesson. Uh, Wesson is five years old. He's a Catahoula Leopard Dog mixed with an American Bulldog. Um, he is uh, a little bit weird with kids. He's great with other dogs though. He's fantastic. Grew up with other dogs. He used to go on uh, off-leash pack walks with other dogs. Very social. Um, his main issue is that he's not very good with strangers. Uh, once he gets to know you, though, he is extremely loving, uh, very sweet dog, loves to wrestle, hang out, he's got a great play style, uh, he's lazy, but also, but also playful at the same time, uh, very good with basic obedience, he's great on leash, uh, doesn't pull hardly at all, um, listens to commands very well, he does need a special, a special kind of owner, someone who doesn't have children, um, someone who doesn't have a lot of company over, possibly. Um, other dogs are okay. Uh, we're not sure about cats, uh, but uh, he's uh, he's a special dog. He definitely definitely will uh, is one that connects with one person, uh, maybe one to two people, and and that's about it. Sit. Yes. Down. 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 almost four years old. He's a pit bull. Um, as you can see, his name fits him. He is good with all dogs, uh, no cats. He is also on a special limited ingredient diet along with a probiotic. He tends to have intermittent diarrhea, so we narrowed it down to food. Um, he's great with people. He loves his Kongs, and he absolutely loves to ride in the car. If you're looking for a travel buddy, any truckers out there, um, this is your guy right here. Again, this is Tank. Thanks for watching Paws for Adoption. Again, um, I'm Katrina White from the Eleanor Sansini Animal Shelter. Um, hopefully, some of you out there will s catch an eye of a dog that uh, you would are interested in adopting or one of our cats. Um, again, we are at 875 Crane Ave in Pittsfield, and our phone number is 413-448-9800. Um, also, we are a no-kill shelter. We are the only one in this area. And uh, we are not associated with any other shelters. We are our own entity. We rely solely on donations and the help of the public. And we appreciate all you guys do for us. Um, if you have any questions about what we need uh, as far as donations, feel free to give us a call. You can check out our website. We have a wish list. It's a pretty big list for me to try and um, uh, name everything that we need. Um, so it would be easier for a phone call. Um, and we thank you so much for watching. Again, pause for adoption. This is a great cause.